Senator John McCain talks about the ramifications of pulling troops out of Iraq. What's at stake here was best described by the president of Iran not long ago, a few couple, three weeks ago, when he said, the United States will leave Iraq and there will be a vacuum and we will fill, there will be a void and we will fill the void. No better description that I know of than what would happen if we set a date for withdrawal and they sat back and waited uh, till we left. So uh, I, I look you right in the eye and I tell you with total confidence that if in the next six months we have the same success that we have the last six months, Americans will be largely satisfied, although there will be still frustration and anger over the way the war was handled, which is totally justified. Ma uh, Rumsfeld will go down with McNamara in history as one of the worst secretaries of defense in the history of this nation. And obviously a lot of that responsibility goes to the President of the United States as well, although at least the President had belatedly fired him and employed a different strategy. So uh, I know of no national security expert, even those who oppose strongly us going into Iraq, people like Brent Scowcroft and General Zinni and others, that believe that if we set a date for withdrawal, it would not, that it would only lead to chaos, genocide, and the region, and we'd be back.